everybody. Welcome to TCM Talk. Um, thanks for watching here and on the replay. The replays you can find out on bit.ly slash periscope pins, all the links to everything we discuss, and bit.ly slash TCM Talk vids. And Kirsten will show you that in just a second after I flip this camera around. Hi. Let's, Hi. let's get Kirsten in the picture. Hello. Oh. <laughs> I'm the short one. <laughs> um, Here's where you can find everything that we talk about and um, archives of all of our videos from TCM Talk. Yes. All right. Thank you, Kirsten. <laughs> We're uh -oh. trying to make sure we can see everybody. Hi. So in this quick scope today, we're going to touch on my top five travel tips uh, for healthy summer travel or travel any time of the year. Um, and uh, because Kirsten did such a great job when she was in Canada a couple of weeks ago and gave you her entire herbal summer travel, her herbal travel kit, mm -hmm. um, she touched on so many things that I love. Um, but here's my top five. Number one. Number one, acupressure. You can use your thumbs. You can use the uh, closed tip of a pen. You can use your knuckles. You can use your elbows for different things. Um, acupressure tips you can see on my do-it-yourself acupressure for travel article, which is on acutichealth.com, and we have links in on the Periscope uh, pins board. Number two. Um, my herbal travel kit is very similar to Kirsten's. Um, I think the one notable exception I can think of is because I'm gluten intolerant, I don't use curing pills. Um, I use a formula called, um, has different names, Huo Shang Jian Chi San, which I'm not expecting y'all to remember because <laughs> it's Chinese. Um, it goes by the name Ease Digestion from Golden Flower Herb Company. Um, it's, there's a couple of different versions out there. So if you are gluten intolerant and would like some something for, to help with digestion, nausea, vomiting, and um, also to help with hangovers, check out um, that formula. Number three, Alphagen. Yay! Yes, yes. We're all big believers. <laughs> <laughs> um, Alphagen. Get Alphagen. Alphagen is spelled A-L-T-I-G-E-N. So getaltogen.com. I have also have a little tiny article about that on my blog. Um, it's a really wonderful formula to help you deal with altitude. Mm. Um, preparing for either if you're going up into the mountains or if you're flying on an airplane. Um, it's pretty miraculous. I just started using it for the first time in January and I usually get altitude headaches um, when I go to the Eastern Sierra, for example. Nothing this time. It was really, really wonderful. Yes, I'm glad to hear that it's great in Colorado. Altogen, I think, actually comes from Colorado, from the Yao Company. I believe they're uh, based yes. in Colorado. Yeah. Um, they know mountains. Yes, they do <laughs> very well. It's also good if you are training for any kind of a big event, like um, if you're going to do a marathon or if you're going to like do something crazy like the AIDS life cycle to Los Angeles like my friend Caitlin just did. Wow. Yeah. Um, Alchogen's great for that. Um, so that's number three. Number four, movement. Move when you're traveling. Do yoga, do qigong. If you're lucky enough to be flying through, um, I think there's one in SFO. There's a yoga room. I'm not sure I haven't found it. There is. There is. I've seen it. I haven't yep. been in it, but I've seen it. Um, I just haven't been traveling through SFO very much myself, um, but in Chicago's Midway Airport, there is a yoga room, and it's pretty awesome. It's really, really chill, and they have nice music. You can either borrow a yoga mat there or bring your own travel yoga mat and just spend some time, you know, chilling out in the yoga room and doing yoga. Thanks for all the hearts. <laughs> um, and... You can do Qigong anywhere you can, as well, you know, while you're waiting in the airport for your next plane. Just simple shaking and tapping your body, you know, wherever you're feeling stiff. We've done some simple tapping before. You can just sort of like go up your arm and down the inside of your arm and do the same with your legs. Um, or just shake, just mm -hmm. shake your forelimbs and, you know, 
don't don't be bothered by what the people think in the airport. Exactly. Or the bus station. They're all doing crazy Whatevs. stuff too. Yeah. <laughs> so that's number four. And number five is leave extra time. Allow extra time for travel because if you don't, if you're running behind or if you, you're short on time for whatever reason, it's just going to add to stress. And stress will add to making travel harder. So we want travel to be as easeful as possible. So um, leave extra time. So quickly, number one, acupressure. Number two, check out my herbal travel kit. Um, and three, altogen. Four, movement. And five, extra time. And that's it for this quick scope. Um, we're going to be back in just a few minutes and we're going to talk about self-care for um, trauma and shock. Um, and we'll be back soon. So bye. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Play. And we'll be, yeah, we'll be back in just a minute or two with, uh, with another scope. Bye.